um, yes. there is another person who has been found murdered. There has been, unfortunately, when we were preparing for this morning's show, Aidan mm. Moffat was in our thoughts mm. because Aidan is featured across all of today's newspapers where his um, body was found, unfortunately, on Monday evening, yeah. brutally murdered. What we have now discovered is last night another body has been found, uh, a 50-year-old man or a man in his 50s, uh, being described as having significant physical injuries, uh, which again is, is particularly shocking. What we've also discovered is that a quarter to two this morning, a man in his early 20s has been arrested by Angar the Shia Khanna who um, went to his home supported by the emergency response unit and that person is now in custody and a murder investigation is being conducted. It's unclear just yet whether those link. two yeah. are linked but also there was a, a on Saturday there was a, another very violent attack in Sligo where somebody was stabbed in the, his eye and, and lost, lost his, his eye. eye. Yeah. So there are three significant attacks, two murders and a particularly brutal attack uh, and brutality is a word that has been being linked across all of them uh, and something obviously has been going on in Sligo and that is yeah. uh, what the guards are yeah. trying to figure out. With Aiden, uh, Aiden Moffat in one of the reports it says it's understood first responders found the scene highly distressing. We can just send our thoughts to his family and we know that his mother's unwell and he spends an awful lot of time at, at home in, in Roscommon. Um, there, it was very quick last night that they said that Gardaí came out with a, with a line of inquiry uh, or that, that they were, would have a line of inquiry because they said please mind yourself on dating apps. Yeah, they came out with that very quickly. I'm basically telling people not to meet on apps, meet in public and maybe do live video calls to talk to the people before you meet them. Do not meet people. They were very clear on that. They were, and that was a, 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 they were pleading with people last night because it is understood that Aidan was last seen on a Sunday afternoon leaving a local pub and it is thought then that he was due to meet somebody he had met on a dating app at home and on guard the Shia Khan's advice for, for everybody who would be using apps is to be obviously very vigilant very careful with yeah. the people that you're meeting because in essence you are meeting a stranger and you don't know who they are uh, and the fact that they linked it so quickly said it so quickly like mm. um, you know our minds are all going well to precisely and they would obviously go through uh, the the data Phones, on his mobile yeah. phone and get the last messages and the last activity on a variety of different apps and it would appear that that has led them to this situation uh, it's frightening to see three attacks like that in the sh very short space of time in Sligo. So I'd say a lot of people are very worried over there at the moment. But as we said, a man has been arrested and he is in custody at the moment.